Hi guys, I'm Rick. Welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm making a pork roast in the Showtime rotisserie oven. Alright, I'm starting out. I have the rotisserie spit rod here, and I have roughly a three pound boneless pork roast. So I'm going to load this down onto the rods. Great. I'm going to try to get through the center of the meat. Now it comes with this handy little holder here. I'm going to sit it down on there. Let me wash my hands. And right, I'm going to put the other end on my spit rods. And this one just sits on here. It doesn't screw on or nothing. All right, I'm going to take this off the stand. And the reason I have this cookie sheet here put some seasoning on this and I don't want to get a mess all over my stove. So, put it right like that since once we're back. I'm going to start out with some garlic powder. I'm just going to put garlic powder and some rosemary on this. I'm going to go simple with it. And I'm trying to sprinkle it lightly on here. It comes out here pretty fast. And you just want to go around the whole thing. Okay, now that I have my garlic powder on there, I'm going to add my rosemary. And I'm just going to sprinkle this around. And I'm going to give it a little pat to pat it on. You could put some cooking spray on this or some olive oil if you like. I'm not doing it because in the rotisserie oven I don't want to splatter any excess grease all over it. It doesn't have to because this is a lot of fat on it that's going to melt down and char up. All right. And like I said, I'm just patting this in here. buy more rosemary because I go through a lot of it. All right. I'm going to take you over here to the other counter where my uh, Showtime group, uh, rotisserie oven is. Okay, I'm going to load this into my oven and you sit on the first notch and then you drop it back so that, that, goes, that goes against the gear. Now this calls for 30 minutes per pound and I'm assuming this is a three pound roast. So I'm going to set this for 90 minutes. All right, my pork roast is almost done. It's gone for the full hour and a half. I'm going to check it one more time for temperature to make sure it's at that 165 to 170. And if it is, I'll take it out and let it rest for five minutes, and then we'll carve it up. All right, my roast is done. It took an hour and a half in the uh, Ronco rotisserie oven, Showtime oven. I left it rest for five minutes, ten it will foil. Let's cut into this and see how it looks. And, uh... I read 174. 165 and 170 is perfect, but 4 degrees isn't going to kill anything. So, it's juicy. So, let's go ahead and uh, serve up the plate and see what we got. Alright, I also went ahead and made some fried potatoes and some carrots for on the side. So, there you have it a pork roast in the Ronco Showtime Rotisserie Oven. Give this a try. I think you'll like it. And until next time, I'll see you.